We made a good song. I am so busy, so busy. These last two weeks have been crazy busy personally for me work-wise. Uh, Lily, uh, she's not gonna walk by because she's uh, on vacation. Good for her, uh, bad for Brittany. Uh, this is vlog nine, clay class. We did a ceramics class. Now, to be fair, full disclosure, I've done ceramics before. I took it in high school. Uh, evidently, it's like riding a bike. That's what I was told with my clay professors. Like, oh, don't worry. It's like riding a bike. It's not like riding a bike. And as we all know, me and bikes don't mix well. <laughs> The Mac has a lot to offer. Anything artistic you kind of want to do, they pretty much have a class for. Okay, I'm heading towards the Mac. Rihanna's not with me right now. So, okay. I'm by myself at the beginning. Rihanna bought a house, good for her. Uh, so she was a little late because she was signing papers and like being an adult. Makes me feel really inadequate most of the time, actually, Rihanna. So thanks, Rihanna. Congrats on the house. We're gonna do the pottery class. So she'll meet me there. So don't worry, she'll be in it. Oh my gosh, these vlogs would be so boring if I was by myself. Hello? Whoa. Whoa. Okay. Or Hi, sorry. I'm Brittany. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Hello. Hey, Rihanna. How's it feel oh, to own a house? Nice to meet nice you. Nice to meet you. Okay. I'm so sorry. No, don't be sorry. Show us how to uh, turn these things into something else. I don't know if I'm gonna be good at this, but finally, you're not good at something. So I'm editing. Realized I never introduced our instructor, Jesse. He's the one who taught us how to make a bowl. So Jesse, he was our instructor, and he was awesome. Mine's gonna be really small and unimpressive. I'm gonna give you two the bigger ones. That's right. <laughs> you know, it doesn't have to be something like ghostworthy, <laughs> just, you know, something, something. I hope it's better than ghostworthy. <laughs> great when it stops. Oh shoot, that's a lot of water. Was it just like riding a bike? Yeah, oh, yes. Especially uh, how you see me ride bikes. I need a break. Sick? I'm scared. <laughs> I'm 
sorry. What am I supposed to be doing right now? Exactly that. class and one window of three hours so you can come in and practice every week. Every week. Yeah, with the cost of your class. We generally have students uh, making three, four, five finished looking pots by the end of the first day. So, end of the first day? Absolutely. Then they're but not as bad as me. That's not a pot. Perfect is boring. You can get perfect for Oh, I agree. You can't afford the kind of creativity you've got on the wheel right now. Look at this. You get a pep talk if you come here. You're not that dirty compared to me. Uh oh. It's <laughs> a little thin at the bottom. I just cut through it. No, no. We're gonna fix it though. There's a big hole in the bottom. <laughs> you know, people think bowls need to be solid on the bottom, but sometimes they need holes. There it is, Rihanna. You gonna give it to your mom? Gotcha. Yeah. yeah. Well, there was no bowl number one. What do you think, Rihanna? It's really good. <laughs> it's a lot better than your last one, man. <laughs> That's it? That is it. Yeah. Look at that. Pretty. You can make stuff. I can make stuff. Alright, check this out. Wait. Scapple. Hi. Hey. What are you making? I'm making a two-headed cow currently. <laughs> my, my best friend uh, called me up the other day and he said, we've been best friends since we were 10 years old. You've never made me anything. Huh? He said, I want a freak show cow. <laughs> All right. Well, I can do that, I think. My pleasure. Nice to meet you. Nice meeting you. We'll uh -huh. see you next Thursday. All right. We'll see you then. He was so nice. He was really nice. He's patient with us. We weren't that great. Where are we going? Where are we going? That's where we're going. So, do we actually paint them? The bowls then? I'm not going to tell you. I'm going to be a surprise. I'm going to guess we dip it. <laughs> we made a good song. What? I'm still me. You guys are ready to do some glazing. My question is, is, do I need to be on camera at all? You are right now. I am already. Okay. <laughs> oh, good. Oh, all right. One of the pieces right here. Yay. I think they were this way. Oh, my God. I survived yeah. the first firing. Yeah. That's step one. <laughs> it didn't fall apart. Hello, Bo. What was this process? This turns into this. Like, did you fire it? Is we it... did. We went through the bisque firing. So that's the initial firing, which converts the clay to ceramic as silica particles begin to bond with the clay particles. Basically, before you, uh, as soon as you finished your pot, you could have put it in a bucket of water and it would have dissolved and turned into just a slurry. Whereas now we could put that into a bucket of water for a thousand years, 20,000 years, and it would be just fine. Um, however, everything hanging from the curtain represents a glaze on top of that base glaze. So we're, one, we're achieving some um, you know, unique results based on the layering and the chemical compositions and how they interact during the firing. I really like this red. I knew you were going to pick it. It kind of matches your shirt. I kind of like, um, where is it? She's very indecisive. So I kind of like this it. one now. Go with this one. Make your decision right here. Um, that is going to be very light, but with a red tone. Flux, clay, some colorants. I guess I'll do it. There you yeah. go. You can't really mess it up, can you? Oh yeah. Yeah, you can. Yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> One and a half and back out again, because we need to go three seconds total. Up like that? Yeah, just in and then back out again. Okay. One and a half seconds. 
There you go, and back down. And now upside down, shake it up and down a little bit to get some of that off of there. Perfect. What's it like on the farm? It's churning butter for food. Your bowl looks actually not that bad. I know, I thought he gave us ones that someone else had made at first because I was like, no way. <laughs> That's good. Shake it out. Your dipping skills are. My dipping skills. Brittany's about to dip her bowl. <laughs> Lovely. Thank you. Has anyone dropped the bowl in there? Oh, all the time. Okay. Yeah. Great. I'm surprised you didn't do it already. Right. Yeah. Good. Good. And there you go. You got it. Shake it up and down to get that extra to come on. Uh, uh, it's sliding off. Oh, Stay. it's okay, don't touch it. That doesn't look yellow. There you go. It does not look yellow. So oh, most of the colors occur based on complex chemical reactions. Well, this is pretty. Crazy that that is just plain white and it's going to change into that color. Incredibly cool. bright colorful blue. Hashtag science. <laughs> don't, don't, don't fall. Don't fall. I sure do. Scraped it twice. Mine scrapes. Okay. We're waiting to paint. Give you some paint brushes. Paint on that. We dipped them in glaze. Rihanna, what colors you're gonna? Be? Rihanna's is gonna be blue and blue purple. Blue some purple, and the paint is gonna be co or copper. I feel like a mar martini, dirty or dry. <laughs> So we'll load this kiln up, sliding all the pots in. Uh, your pots will go somewhere in this area. Uh, and then we're gonna wheel it down the rack here and into, the, into this kiln. Best case scenario, we're looking at getting it fired um, next week. Is there anything you wanna say to people who might be interested in taking a ceramics class? Take a class, absolutely anybody can do it. Um, there's nothing about this that is, you know, you have to be inherently artistic or have some background in uh, working with your hands. Um, we can get anybody to throw a pot on the wheel within one to two class periods. It's a challenge, uh, it's difficult, but um, it's a lot of fun. We'd love to have everybody in, so. Well, thank you, you're awesome. Thank you. Um, all right, we'll see you. All right. Thank you so much. Yeah. Bye, pots. <laughs> it's the two cow head guy. Putting on this uh, harness. Uh, so kind of... Yeah, it looks great. I'm just glad that we saw you. We can update people on the cow situation. It's looking great. Oh, thank you. All right, well, good luck, man. Yeah. Nice seeing you. Good to see you, too. I am so excited to see what our bowls are going to look like. Unfortunately, I don't have... I, I waited long enough to show you just the dipping process. I ha We had to wait a whole week just to show that. So to show them finished, I'd have to potentially wait two weeks. This is a weekly vlog. Ain't got that time. So whenever they're done, either on Facebook Live or one of the vlogs, whatever one it's ready for, we will show them and we'll put them uh, in the area and they'll be on the set. They'll be set pieces. Mac clay class. So really quick, I will list all the different type of classes that the Mac offers for adults because I'm an adult. Ceramics, glass, graphic arts, jewelry slash metal, movement, music, photography, sculpture, theater, and miscellaneous. Miscellaneous? Intriguing. Don't know what that means. Plenty to go around in the Mac. Not just a place to go grab a great show or buy some art. You can make art. That's awesome. I'm just going to act like this is an obvious set. I'm purposely planting uh, my decals on my Mac like Casey Neistat does. Totally not intentional. You weren't even supposed to notice it. Dustin Hoffman's amazing. I once photoshopped myself in a picture with Dustin Hoffman from a scene from Kramer vs. Kramer. Great movie if you hadn't seen it, by the way. Up here, that's the picture I photoshopped. And I put it on Instagram and I hashtagged Dustin Hoffman and Dustin Hoffman's wife liked the picture. One of the proudest moments of my life. So vlog 10 is a brewery. Oro Brewing, downtown Mesa. Pretty cool 
independent small brewer and we're going to go with them tomorrow morning actually to see them start the brewing process talk to them about their brews what made them do it all that good stuff micro brewing is booming so we're gonna go check one out and we had multiple uh, requests for that actually to to do that so that's what we're gonna do for you guys uh that will be vlog 10 vlog 10 is a brewery in downtown mesa and just talking about other breweries that you could possibly visit in the city. Vlog 10, double digits, really excited for it. It's gonna be next week. Check it out, Real Mesa. Make sure you keep subscribing. Thanks so much for everything so far. Keep suggesting. We have many suggestions coming in. See you then. Thanks for watching. You guys are awesome. I'm just gonna tilt this down into the desk.